everybody. Welcome back to another great episode of Just Create. I'm your host, Thomas Duran. And, uh, you know, I tell you what, I'm really, really excited about this next guest that's coming on uh, to this next episode. Now, when I first started my business and got into just trying to make ends meet and just because I want to do what I love to do and make money to do what I love to do. I, the only way I knew how to make money was trading hours for dollars type thing. And so um, little did I know that there are so many different other avenues and, uh, and, and ways to be able to create new revenue streams, even within your business that you have going on. And one of those avenues is, is, is through affiliate marketing. Now, I don't know about you, but I know a lot of people that are, are that are involved with it. I know a lot of people are successful with it, but I do know, like myself, there's a lot of people that have no idea exactly what affiliate marketing is, how to even begin, who is it for, how to maximize on it. And, 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 and there is a lot of, you know, there's been some bad connotation, you know, with it as well. So in order to dispel all those rumors and to, and to clear things up, I decided to bring on an expert. And that expert is the founder and chief coach of Performance Marketing Manager, Dustin Howes. How you doing, my buddy? That's me. That's hey. me. Hey, I'm doing great. <laughs> that, that is you. That is you. Yeah. How you doing, Tom? <laughs> Man, so guys, this guy, this, it, Dustin, is a, this guy is it brings a lot of energy, brings a lot of knowledge, um, and I, I'm so happy for you to to be on this uh, on this show. And so, thank you for taking your time and coming on, buddy. Oh, great to be here. Let's get this rolling. How are you doing, friend? I am doing fantastic. You know, uh, actually, right after this show, I'm, I'm heading off to sort of in your area, right? In Northern Cal. So oh, yeah. heading off to San Jose for a couple of days to get some uh, for uh, some video work done over there. But um, but uh, yeah, no, things are going great. Things are getting really busy and try to finish out the new year. <laughs> Good, good. So, yeah. But uh, yeah, man, how are you? So how are things going for you? I, I mean, like I said, you are the expert in in this affiliate market. What is this affiliate marketing all about? I want to. But before we kind of dive in that, just introduce yourself to to all the viewers about who you are and how you got started and, and a little bit about something a little bit something a little funny about yourself. Mm, something funny about myself. Yeah. I got to entertain you. Am I a clown now? Thanks, Thomas. <laughs> uh, yeah. So me. <laughs> me, me, uh, nutshell, uh, high school, Marine Corps, college, uh, didn't know what to do with my life. And uh, I found uh, my uh, uh, girlfriend, now wife, uh, who was working for this company called Commission Junction. And she got me my first job in this uh, market of affiliate marketing a little over 10 years ago. So I've been doing this for a decade, uh, doing a, a myriad of different kind of jobs in the industry and um, I was running programs and one day I, I figured out exactly how much revenue the companies <laughs> I was working for were making from the hard work that I was doing and how I wasn't getting any bonuses for it or anything like that. Ain't and that I was, something? <laughs> yeah. Uh, and so I just figured out, you know, I need to be in business for myself. Uh, what can I do? So I started doing my own consultancy and, and then I figured out, you know, there's just not enough knowledge out there and training for exactly what I do. So I went out to help the community figure out uh, how to manage affiliate programs properly because there's just so many people that don't know how to do it or, or do it on a whim and jump into it and just <laughs> don't know what they're doing. Right. So, I mean, it, I feel like the, it, it requires a guide. I feel like it requires a guide and, and anyone that try, tries to jump into something like that. I mean, I, I'm for one trying to jump into things and try to figure things out. But mm -hmm. uh, I think there's been two, two, two major things that I just I just haven't been able to do that. That's uh, one uh, dealing with Infusionsoft software. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, amen. Oh my God. Like, <laughs> sorry, oh. sorry, sorry. All it gets better. It, yeah, gets better. it, it does. It does. Uh, and then to affiliate marketing, you know, like, like I, I feel like there's a so much like just great potential and, and just great, um, way to maximize other revenues. And so, um, so I'm so happy to kind of be on board and, and for people that are beginning, maybe they have a job like the, if like, or have their own company, like, 
you know, what is affiliate marketing? So kind of, kind of telling me a little, talk a little bit about that. What exactly is affiliate marketing? All right. Yeah. So affiliate marketing, you have uh, a couple of different players in affiliate marketing. So the one you start with the merchant, we'll call them Apple. Everybody knows Apple. Apple wants more sales. They want more traffic to their website. How do they get that? They go through affiliates. So affiliates bring that traffic over to, to Apple and through their website, through emails, whatever venue that they might do. Social influence is huge right now. YouTube video is monstrous, sending traffic that way, uh, huge. And we'll get into that a little later, but that's the basis of it. And then in the middle is the tracking software, the people that manage these programs and manage these kinds of relationships. And that's what I'm good at. That's what I do. And that's what I teach people how to do. So basically affiliate marketing uh, kind of has a negative connotation to it. A lot of, a lot of people in this industry have uh, ruined it uh, via fraud. And there's a lot of affiliates that could be shady. You, you never see, you never hear from. They're kind of ghosts really. <laughs> and, and, and those are the guys that um, have made the bad name for the industry. But what I'm out there trying to do and help the community understand is building those relationships is super important to expanding the growth of that company and get that merchant more uh, revenue in the long run altogether. No, oh, that is fantastic. And, and so, you know, we were kind of discussing this in the way that kind of helped me understand it a little bit. It's, it's a very much a, 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 a referral program. And, uh -huh. and, and yeah. it is a good way to kind of put it. Um, Very good. So who is affiliate marketing for? Like when, who's it for and when should someone start doing affiliate marketing? So affiliate marketing is another channel for anybody that might be running a business like you and uh, want to refer people over to a business like me. I would not happy to give you, you know, X amount of percent for sending me those good leads from your uh, very nice referral. Um, it could be personal, it could be through a link, whatever it may be. Um, I forgot the question now, what am I, what am I talking about? <laughs> Who's it for? Who's, Who's it, it for? for? And, 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 and when, when should someone start it? Yeah. When should somebody start it? Um, I don't preach that you start doing affiliate marketing and, and until you've uh, got your website optimized and, and you know what you're doing, but uh, affiliates can, can start at any time. Um, a lot of people may get into ads, Google ads, uh, used to be called AdSense, but uh, they might right. get paid per click. But the great thing about affiliate marketing is you can make a lot more money if you're doing it properly with, and giving those um, referral based uh, traffic to those those merchants so um, you have a potential to make a lot more money than just people clicking and it means a lot more to building those relationships which is awesome too so you can start at any time you just have to figure out where to get the links and uh, right. make sure that the tracking is is properly in place on your website okay okay so and that do you uh, like, do you, do people just choose like specific companies they want to refer to, you know, like it sounds like it's more of a relationship or it should be more of a relationship yeah. type environment where uh, let's say, for example, I, because I'm in video production and, uh -huh. and with this show, I like to bring on different creatives. I like to bring on different people, but, um, let's say for example, someone's asking me, Hey, uh, how did you shoot this show? Like what camera did you use? Like, would, mm. it, would that be like something where it's like, I could refer them over to say a, a website, B and H for example, or Amazon for like, as another great example and yeah. saying, here's the camera, here's the link to get this camera. Would Perfect. that be so like, it was sort of a, like the, it, yeah, a great absolutely. Idea. I, I suggest, um, adding some kind of page on your website for you, it would be like an equipment page or, um, uh, I don't know, um, suggested materials page. So people are coming to you as an expert 
to learn more about how to do what you do, right? right. Uh, they need to know what equipment you're using. So you might have a page set up and then it says, this is the camera to go to and it's an affiliate link to Amazon or wherever it might be that you would buy that. And then you get credit if they ended up buying. So that can be a really nice additional revenue for you just doing a little bit of work uh, at, at the time. And then it kind of sits there for, for quite a while while your page grows on its own. For someone that's starting off new, why is it somewhat sort of confusing or scary in that regards? Because you mentioned a little bit about some of the stuff that's happened in the past and that's, mm -hmm. that's some fraudulent stuff. That's, mm -hmm. some, you know, was that, is that through the, the actual affiliates or the people that were giving money try, or the people that are trying to use affiliates? What kind of discuss a little bit about that and, and try to, what, what do you do? What, how would you encourage people to start using this system again? Sure. So, um, all the risk is on the merchant side, okay. but the risk, can be minimized if you know what you're doing and you have your program set up properly, which are all the techniques that I teach in my course. Um, and if you're an affiliate, there's no risk to you. You can join any kind of program you want and it's, and it's going to be free and you can just start sending traffic uh, and see what hits and see if you can uh, get some additional revenue coming in. So all the risk is on the, the merchant side um, and, and people get really, on the merchant side, they're, they kind of get scared of this industry because they don't know how to control it sometimes. They might get, um, they might get affiliates that they don't know about uh, that looks like it's good traffic or maybe it's traffic coming from a coupon site and they can't really tell if that revenue that these affiliates are bringing in uh, is real. And uh, my course goes over that very extensively. Um, teaching you what is real and what isn't, what what kind of sales are coming in that uh, you probably would have got anyway. Um, so yeah, yeah, it can be a little bit scary, but um, with the right training, anything's uh, within reach, and and I can make it really easy. And hmm, there there's a place to go where there's a place to go to get this training. Hmm. Hmm. I'm trying to think. Uh, hmm. <laughs> uh, I believe performance. You know. I, 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 What's that? I believe you have a link, don't you? Yes. Hmm. Yes, I actually do have a link that I uh, will be posting here uh, in the because uh, uh, you said like you could do, you post it on so many different platforms. This will be posted through my website. It'll be posted through uh, the YouTube, my YouTube yeah. channel. You'll be able to scroll down the comments, click on the link and actually head over to Dustin's uh, website and 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 um and learn all about his program. So can I tell a little bit about that? I've had the privilege of, of helping you create that program as in shoot it, you know, yeah. I, I didn't create it. You're the knowledge man on it. But like, uh, I, I had the, the pleasure of being able to be a uh, part of that. And then I tell you what is, is truly absolutely amazing. Tons of value in it, but kind of share to us what that program is, what people can expect. Sell yeah. It, yeah. Sell it. <laughs> <laughs> Awesome. So I'm out there trying to help people. Um, these these programs, affiliate programs, people are scared of them. People don't know what they're doing. And in 10 hours, I can give you a year's worth of affiliate management experience. So these courses that you uh, videoed for me very well, very classily. I think that's a word. Uh, I'll take it. I'll take yes. it. Um, uh, they... they help you understand in the easy to read understand format. So there is a ton of different materials out there about how to run an affiliate program. But the reason I built this course essentially is all of that stuff was really boring to read. And I'm not a person that likes to read. And a lot of the content was outdated. And I just decided, you know, I'm going to start fresh. I'm an entertainer. I like to get out there and, and tell people in a, in a fun voice and keep them happy and, and listening. So, uh, I got out there and, and just, just went out there and did it. And, um, it's awesome. It, uh, it, uh, I, I, here's the thing. It really was awesome. You did bring, uh, this is where I, I'm sort of jealous because, uh, you know, <laughs> I'm usually behind the camera when I came out in front of camera and trying to learn doing this, uh, 
you know, there's it, it, it's tough because, you know, you, you have to be sort of uh, very, very entertaining in order for people to be engaged. And and uh-huh. so sometimes I, I'll admit I'm not that naturally entertaining. However, my friend, you, on the other hand, have that natural capability and you have some pretty massive skills that you do during your training, like, a, you know, something like a double toe touch. Oh, uh, jump. <laughs> I can't believe we got that on video. That is awesome. <laughs> the highlight of the course. Yeah, oh my God. It was the climax of the course. <laughs> yes, yeah. <It> was... <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, it was, uh, that was really, really impressive. Uh, so, you know, needless to say, if, if nothing else, you should take the course just to see the double toe touch. <laughs> the double toe touch uh, with, I don't get embarrassed easy. Um, <laughs> First off, I'll tell you that I have nearly zero shame. Um, <laughs> so when I did that double toe touch and my pants split in half, <laughs> the coverage and put it and slice it into this video because that's what you do. Uh, feel free to do it and really highlight the the volume on my pants. I think you got it, didn't you? I I, <laughs> I think I heard some ribbage and yeah. I heard like. Oh shit! <laughs> I just, I just and this was like towards the last day. <laughs> I, I tried my best to play it off, play it cool, and say, "Hey, we'll we'll be right back after this commercial." <laughs> like I was a game show. Like, was <laughs> like, like there was actual commercials. To, to yeah. This. <laughs> like, here, let me uh, throw up some lower thirds here for you. Oh my god, that was so hilarious! I, I I couldn't. I even today when I was editing that, I couldn't stop laughing. So yeah, we'll 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 make sure that is definitely <laughs> available to watch. But awesome. uh, <laughs> um, but but in all seriousness, when you went in and, and and put this together, and and actually, I kind of wanted this is sort of kind of leading to one of my things I really want to kind of discuss about because I feel like we have we're, we're what do they call it? Kindle spirits or kinder spirits or, you know, like we. Kindred, I believe. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. What, you know, we share Kindle. a lot of Kindle. Yeah. We, we read our hearts. Yeah. We, we share books <laughs> we online do. together. We, we, <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's what we do. It's just what we do. Um, but uh, yeah, kinder spirits, I think is what they would, it is, but uh, oh my God. Anyway. Um, where the hell was I going with this? I was I going, know. oh, yes. I, I the, And what that is, is that you, you earlier ago, you, you mentioned, <laughs> you mentioned like, I was working for a company and I saw how much money I was making. <laughs> and now I'm like, and you realize you're like, huh, I should be doing this on my own. Like, like, like you just, it's just absolutely outrageous. And that was the same thing that happened to me where I've always yeah. wanted to go into video. And I actually, I had a sales background. And so when I was doing mortgages <laughs> before I went into Ooh. full-time in video and I was just selling, I was just, it was on the phone and I was cranking them out. And I, t- and, and even though we were commissioned, they were always changing it. Like, because they only wanted you to hit a certain amount. And when you hurt that certain amount, they're going to lower it down. And so, um, <laughs> so sounds like a terrible structure. Oh, it's a horror. It's hor- like every, every like two, three months they would change <laughs> like this point system to, to, to get your bonus. And it's just, it was just, it's annoying, but, yeah. um, it was that carrot that they, you could never grab. You could just never get, you know? And, but, uh, but I, but I had sort of that aha moment of what the hell, why, why am I selling something? I don't give a crap about sure. and not take that and just start selling for myself and about mm-hmm. something I do like to do. Yeah. And I get to keep everything. Like, yeah. like it's like one of those. Just so I, I went out on my own and and started my own business. And, and so in yeah. that, and seeing you start your own business, going out and move, going, throwing all your ducks in a row or all tuck ducks in a row. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not very good with these with these analogies here. Um, You're not nailing it. No, no, that's it, all right. It actually turns out it's it's better anyway. Yeah. My wife. Uh, with, is terrible at these. One time, she her her best one ever to this date was, well, that's the camel that broke the straws back. <laughs> <laughs> and she hates when I tell that story. <laughs> she'll love watching that. Yeah, but, you know, 
<laughs> it is what it is, right? It's a camel that broke the straws back. Sure. But yeah. but you yeah. see what I'm saying? Like like you you had that moment, you just jumped down there and uh-huh. how what was that moment like for you? What was that how is it going so far? Like, I mean, that's uh-huh. it's just kinda of tell me about your experience about that. I mean it, it it's always terrifying. Um to make that that leap by from going to a full time job, especially since I have two small kids, um, two and four years old, and it's it's scary giving up that really nice nest egg of a continuous paycheck uh, to go and drop it all and and do this. Um, yeah, putting my ducks in a row though, yeah. uh, <laughs> I did <laughs> throwing them all all those ducks in there. <laughs> Just, uh, barrel of monkeys together and, and uh, yeah yeah it was it was very calculated like uh before you know even telling my boss i i had to you know be quiet about it of course and um build it up on my own on my spare time only like i don't like to take company time so i would never do any of that and uh it was it was grueling man i was getting up at four o'clock every morning or at least, you know, five days a week uh, so that I can get that time in on my own stuff before taking the kids to school and then getting to my work day. So grueling, absolutely grueling. I'm glad I don't have to work out, wake up at four anymore uh, now that I've taken the leap. And um, But uh, having that, the, the friends there, <clears throat> the mentors, the uh, people that have done it and, and – preaching about it like and and poking you and pushing you to to do it um that's really powerful to have that kind of network behind you um friends like you and and sarah will all pushing me all all the way uh to get to the point where i'm at and i'm super happy i'm so much happier (laughs) after you know uh starting this venture on my own and and you know, it hasn't even been like four months. I'm already making more money than I was when wow. I was doing full time work. So, uh, really excited that I've taken the leap. But uh, my best advice to anybody is never, never take it without like, without calculating all those risks. I mean, it's <laughs> it is scary, no doubt. But um, you know, I'm I'm a gambler by nature, so. Uh, I, was, I, was <laughs> I learned this about you when we, we were, yeah. we were <laughs> so we're, <laughs> yeah. quick story. We were, we were out in Vegas uh, doing our little mastermind together. And, and that's the, that's the, where I first met you. Right. Was that was, was in Vegas yeah. and, um, <laughs> and we're sitting at the roulette table and here I am, I'm putting in like, you know, my chips and how much ever I wanted. And then, and then you're like, no, dude. And you just take my stack of chips, <laughs> you just slap it down. I was like, I'm going to go with it. And lo and behold, we won. We won. Man, I was like, All every right, time, every I, I'll take this guy's luck any day, man. So full proof, full proof plan. <laughs> yeah. Every time, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just like, who is this guy taking my chips? <laughs> yeah, I'm the <laughs> asshole. <laughs> but uh, I'll never forget it. It was awesome. It was awesome. But uh, uh, one of the things I kind of want to talk about. So, so actually, before we kind of talk a little bit about your videos that you do, which I absolutely love. Um, and people can obviously start, uh, I suggest go to these videos and submit their questions in, cause I'll let you kind of, uh, you know, talk a little bit about that, but, um, uh, tell, is there anything else you want to kind of share a little bit more about your program and, 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 and why it's just so valuable for people and what they can expect from it? Uh, well, the biggest thing I want to, you know, let everybody that's listening to this know is, you're a friend of mine and I'm happy to give out free advice to just about anybody that's looking for help with their affiliate program. So I'll offer everybody here a free 20 minute consultation. Um, you're going to go to, uh, your link, yep. which I'm pretty sure it's going to be tdfilms.com slash Dustin. Dustin. Mm-hmm. Um, that'll lead you to the, the page where you, uh, sign up for a free phone call, 20 minutes. You can ask me anything. I'm not going to sell you anything. Um, and I only talk to people to, to just help them. And, you know, if they need my additional help, yeah, you can sign up for my course or I, I can help you out in other ways. Um, but I'm just going to give you the, the right guidance to what you need. Maybe you just have a couple of quick questions like, 
uh, you, you might think that there's fraud in your program or <clears throat> you don't know how to handle this kind of situation with this kind of affiliate. I'm here to help. So just come and take advantage of that, please. Um, Absolutely. I, I, I highly encourage everyone to take advantage of that. Like I said, the link will be uh, posted below and also it'll be, you know, you'll see it here coming out right up on the little lower yeah. thirds. You'll be able to go on my website. So there's there's no excuse for for them to take advantage of yeah. this opportunity here. And, and I appreciate that very much. Yeah. So obviously we established you're an entertainer. You bring a lot of, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of uh, energy, energy, mm -hmm. good energy, you know, uh, good. <laughs> yes. This is like sticking in the ass. Or Sky <laughs> punch. Sky punch. <laughs> it's like Street Fire. <laughs> <You know? laughs> Ryu is his name, or I don't know. Yeah. yeah, right. Yeah. Ken, depending on which one you like. Right. Ken was the American, right? So, yes, he was. Yeah, so America. America. You gotta, you gotta love America. Uh, <laughs> but uh, uh, you do these videos, and, and you you bring on. I love them. And this is where I, this is, you are the perfect example of why I encourage people just to go out, think of a, something very simple to do, but put yourself in front of camera and just be who you are. And sure. it doesn't have to be anything like a production based type thing. It's just more of, yeah, I, you see, you're just sitting, you're just chilling, <laughs> drinking lemonade or whatever it is that you're doing. <laughs> But you yeah. take questions, you take questions. You're like, you pick out two questions. So people submit questions to you and you take these two questions and you just answer them. And you know, they're questions about the, obviously all the thing, everything about affiliate marketing. Mm -hmm. But I mean, it, 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 and one, so, and then there's other videos where you actually try out products. Like I've seen like when you did the beer, you're like the pomade. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> People, you don't understand. Dustin had a massive beard. Like, I, I want sure. that back, man. I want that back. But no, it's not coming back. No, it's, it's done for sure. It's annoying. I mean, maybe. I'll, who knows? You never know what I'm going to come out with next. <laughs> so exactly. I, I came really close to giving you Captain Half Beard today. Oh. Uh, pulling it off. Uh, but I came really close to doing it. God, uh, and you grow it like in two days, which is sure. pisses me yeah. off. Like, yeah. I. Takes me forever to grow something. Not everybody's got facial hair hubris like I do. <laughs> that is that is the truth. It is absolutely impressive. But hey, so your videos. <laughs> Back sure. to your videos. Like what 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 inspires you to do that? I mean, like what 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 how how do you, you you're so comfortable in front of it, man? Like I say, you're so naturally yeah. talented in, in that and showing that personality and it's just extremely entertaining. What is it about doing those videos? As well, number one, why do you do them? Number two, yeah. what's the importance of it, and, and what kind of uh, what kind of response are you getting from them? Uh, so the, the couple of different ones. Like, I decided that you know, since I I quit doing full time work for anybody else, uh, I've got basically 50, 60 hours a week uh, just to work on my own business, and. I decided, you know, I'm not going to do just work all week. That, that sounds terrible to me. <laughs> so I'm going to cut that up with uh, doing one fun thing a week. And that's creating skits, um, uh, coming up with ideas of like how to promote certain products. You know, my YouTube channel isn't big, but if uh, one of those videos just hits, oh who knows God. where it's going to go, right? Exactly. I, might, I might pivot my company and start doing YouTube videos full time. That's the dream, right? Is... Uh, but uh, yeah, but, so I started doing uh, little promotional videos. YouTube affiliates are just gigantic right now. I can't emphasize that enough. Um, there's a guy uh, from... Uh, the, can't can't disclose names. Gotcha. Uh, Fair contacts, obviously, <laughs> but I have seen millions on millions of hits on YouTube videos that just promote one product or one little thing, and that will drive a crazy amount of traffic to that merchant, and, mm -hmm. and you know, net them six figures each month. And that oh video gosh. just lives forever. Uh, they keep growing more content and adding on to that and then adding to the comment section so that they rank well on SEO uh, for Google and 
and optimizing it. It's uh, it's just a, a great way to get into the game if you're entertaining. And that's what I was trying to do. And then um, with my business, when I was uh, starting in Corona, I was like, I just want to create like five minute videos, uh, keep attention spans like mine um, involved. And so I decided, you know, I'll answer one marketing question and one personal question. That's all I do, and, and it's quick, three to five minutes, uh, I knock it out, and the first couple of weeks I made up the questions on my own, and and, and just like pretended to pick things out of a hat, oh, look at this question from it's Mark. Cassidy. <laughs> yeah, Cassidy. <laughs> Thanks, Cassidy. Yeah. Uh, and, and then I answered the questions. It's all like uh, preemptive, I know what I'm doing, I just, uh, you know, doing my best to act like it's in the moment. Um, oh, it's great. It, I, 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 I can't tell you how much entertainment it is. It, it really, yeah. I, I'm part of me so, has a little bit of jealousy to it. Cause they're, they're not everyone could pull that off. But, <laughs> but uh, yeah, the first two episodes, uh, they, they went well. I just posted on Facebook and LinkedIn and, uh, I got, I have enough questions for the next like six, seven episodes now at this point. That's awesome. So uh, I'll do another one this week and then uh, probably launch it on Friday. And you, do you just use your phone? Like, what do you use? I mean, cause it's not, uh, I, the whole idea is I want to stress that you don't have to have a big production. No, you know, no, not at all. Um, I use my MacBook pro just like I'm using right now. It's this camera right here. Uh, I, I know very little about video production, but I know you have, you usually need good lighting, so I try not to have shadows on my face, and that's about it. Uh, using, using the MacBook um, uh, microphone, usually. Yeah. Uh, I don't know how to edit, so it's it's purely raw, like you said. Uh, <laughs> but it, it's fun. It's a lot of fun. And then video editing on a MacBook takes, I don't know, like five, ten minutes at this yeah, point. It doesn't Splice take long. a five-minute video. It's so simple, like, uh, and I, I learned it all on the fly. Maybe, maybe it took me four hours altogether the first time, and now it takes me, you know, yeah, less less than one to do everything at this point. It, that's that is the key, and and the way software uh, sophomores. Oh my god, I cannot talk today. The way oh. softwares uh, that have developed, you know, with Final Cut and what they've done with to make like an iMovie for your. Because uh -huh. everyone, I believe everyone gets iMovie now uh, when you buy a Mac, but uh, it's it's just super easy to use, very basic, you, and it doesn't take much to 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 put something together, put something entertaining together, and uh -huh. and uh, and you're just not the the thing I like about it is that you could tell you're just not afraid, and that's why I always try to tell people don't be afraid about what people think, what you think is going to be reaction, like you don't care, you just go and do it, and the reaction is we want more. Right, like that's <laughs> so true. It's so hard to train that into people, though. It's it, virtually impossible. I don't, uh, I don't know when I lost all my shame, but I remember <laughs> being, I remember being in high school and trying to be cool, but I was just naturally a goofy dude. Uh, and uh, one day I was, so I, I went, I joined the Marine Corps, and then I went to college, and just one day something clicked, and I was like, I don't give. I don't give any cares anymore. <laughs> I absolutely love it. Just fresh out of them. Like, and uh, then I just did what I want. And um, I ended up meeting my wife uh, by being a goofy guy. So uh, you are who you are. Just own it. And, and uh, don't worry about professionalism. I think professionalism is kind of overrated, honestly. Like, I know my shit. And if you want to come to me for advice, I'm going to entertain you and make you laugh. I'm going to, <clears throat> but I'm going to give you valid information. And if I don't know the answer, I'm going to be straightforward because I'm an honest dude too. Uh, I don't take on all the clients that come to me, like trying to give me money. Uh, if I'm not going to give you the value that you need, then I'm, I'm not the right fit and I'll try to guide you in the right way. But uh, I mean, this life's too short not to have fun with uh with your clients with your friends and i like to make friends and i like to make uh, new connections with everybody and and that energy just compounds everybody everybody joins in 
and um, it's been working for me so far. You said it beautifully. It's about doing what you want, not being fearful, and just going after it. You left the job that you were comfortable at, and you went and got and did your own thing. You go and make your own videos. You don't care what people think. You just have the attitude of, I'm going to do it, <laughs> and, and either people are going to love it or they don't like it. But it doesn't matter. You're going to get a reaction. You're going to get a response either way and that's what, what that's what's just so powerful um and and i want you i just want to say dude you keep on doing it i can't wait to, to the next ones um where can people find you like uh what what you know your social media your your uh website where, where can everyone find you uh easiest way to find all of it uh going to tdfilms.com slash dustin and that'll take you to the page. That'll take you to the landing page for uh, the 20 minute free consultation. But you can check out my site um, and, you know, dustinhouse.com. You can always get a hold of me there. Uh, I'm very easy to contact if you go to those two places. Um, very receptive via email and, uh, you know, whatever you need help with. Let me, uh, let me see if I can help you. All right, my friend. Well, thank you so much for joining Just Create today. I got to have you back on. We'll do some more, and we should actually do some videos together. Uh, yes. I should just fly out to to fly out to uh, fly out to Sacramento. Well, you know where yeah, you're at. Sacramento, yeah, Sacramento. Sacramento. You know, yeah. Fly out to Sacramento, and then we could go do some fun stuff. But, uh, yeah. uh, but buddy, I just want to say thank you for joining in. And, uh, guys, as we wrap up, I want to say thank you. Please go ahead and subscribe. Hit the notification button so you receive, you know, you'll receive notice uh, when the next uh, when the next episode comes about. Also, below the comments, like I said, there will be the link to uh, to head over to Dustin's page that you'll be able to go ahead and use and uh, get that free consultation with him. He is uh, absolutely amazing. And why not? We've got to learn how to do it, be able to start creating some new revenues and uh, and just create. Just continue to keep on creating, putting yourself out there, and uh, good things will happen. So until next time, guys, thank you very much. I hear the music coming. Yep, there it is. I'll talk to you guys later. See you later. Bam. We're good. Dude, that was right. awesome. That was great. That was a lot of fun. Awesome. How'd so you, you go? Um. Oh, great. Uh, so I put these shorts on just to do this. Oh, wait, you forgot the double. Yes, yes, I'm recording. So here, I'll put this at the, uh, I'll, uh, let's put this. Let's, let's, we got to do this double toe touch. You want, you want a live version. Let's get a live version. All right, well, let me straighten out. I'm not prepared for this, so. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a second here. <laughs> That's it. That's what I'm talking about. That's the energy you need. <laughs>